Even though a lot of my past research has focused on this connection between shallow and deep reef areas, I've obviously become more and more interested in deep reefs for their own right. And that's because they harbor this unique biodiversity. Corals at depths, at mesophotic depths, look very differently from the shallow. Just like plants growing in high light or low light environments, they have different morphologies. And so the trick is to figure out if we do find these species down there and they look differently, figure out are they different species? Is that genetically determined or are they just different growth forms? At great depths, we find very distinct specialized communities. At more intermediate depths, so at the start of this mesophotic zone, we do still find quite a few species that are shared with the shallow. And maybe not in the same numbers as we do find in the shallow, but we do find them there. And so even though those species might not contribute to active recovery of shallow reef areas, they might still ensure that species survive through certain disturbance events and so prevent local extinction.